things obviously got started with the Russell Wilson trade to Denver, while the rest have looked to bolster their defenses in recent days, including the Chargers, adding Khalil Mack to that already impressive defensive line. Stephen A., does the AFC West still run through Patrick Mahomes when you're looking at the quarterbacks that we have in this division now? Until further notice, I would say yes. Um, I'm fully aware of the fact that the Cincinnati Bengals beat them in the AFC Championship game. I'm fully aware of the fact that Buffalo should have beaten them because Josh Allen did deliver a touchdown with 13 seconds left, and for some reason, Buffalo's defense couldn't prevent uh, Patrick Mahomes and them from getting in the field goal range in 13 seconds. Dallas Cowboys couldn't get off a snap in 14 seconds, but... Kansas City can drive down the field in 13 seconds. Eat on that one. Black That'll make no 13. damn sense. Hey, can you okay? stop? That's two it, cowboy it, references it, it, we did it, not it, it's need. It's just the truth. It's just okay, the truth, stop. okay? It's just the truth. But I'm telling you this. In the AFC West, somehow, some way, no matter what uh, the, Ve the Las Vegas Raiders do, no matter what the Denver Broncos do, no matter what the Chargers do, Somehow, some way, at least in recent memory, Kansas City continues to find a way. Now, there's Justin Herbert, Russell Wilson, and Derek Carr, who got finally got, oh, you know, you got the Raiders to the playoffs to deal with. And I get that. And I'm not saying they're going to win every game within the division. I'm just saying Kansas City, Patrick Mahomes is still that dude. Travis Kelsey is still that dude. Tyreek Hill is still that dude when it comes to going up against the AFC West. Yeah. And until further notice... I'm just going to stick with Kansas City for the time being, even though I'm a huge Justin Herbert fan, and I love SoFi. It is a special <laughs> stadium. It really is. All right, here we go. Here we go. And, and it's about to go stupid on my mentions. Los Angeles Chargers. I, I think these moves that they made really? put them Big squarely Jackson, in the number yeah. one spot. Really? J.C. Jackson, man. Big Stephen time. A., I talked about this on SportsCenter almost a day or two after the Super Bowl, and their number one target should have been a lockdown corner, and they got him. I did not see them getting Khalil Mack. And let me let let me put America on notice. Yes, if, you <laughs> if you don't think if you don't think we gonna see a different Khalil Mack than we saw in Chicago, with an opportunity to win a championship, and Stephen A, you've been you you've been covering this game longer than I've been around. You know what a change of scenery oh, and a different opportunity does for particular players. It ain't like we talking about Khalil Mack ain't still good. We just going to see Khalil Mack go back to that level we saw him right. when he was with the Oakland Raiders. No Across question. from Bosa and, uh, and, oh. and Sneaky. Oh, yes. They signed yeah. a guy by the name Bosa. of Sebastian Joseph Day from the Los Angeles Rams because their issue was trying to stop the run. Well, they made, they made a plan – to get that done too. Let's pause for a second. Let's let's is the Mac Daddy Khalil Mac. You ain't got to convince me. I know. I know he was. I know he was contaminated by what was transpiring in Chicago. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And J C Jackson is that dude. The brother special. Don't I forget, like him a lot. Don't forget Derwin James over there. But, but that's absolutely. Don't, don't forget. You know, no, no, Devin James. No question about it. But I'm just talking about Sebastian for a second. Let's understand the importance of of, of this brother. How smooth he is. He said. I ain't leaving L.A. I ain't leaving L.A. I ain't leaving L.A. <laughs> I'm going to be right here. I'm going to be right here. <laughs> I mean, it don't make no difference to me. Place, place I, ain't got to change, I ain't got to change the dress. Yeah. I ain't got to change. The, the weather conditions don't change. My wardrobe don't yeah. have beautiful. to change. Yeah. Nothing. I'm beautiful. good. That's a beautiful move no, on no, his no, part. for sure. That's a beautiful move from L.A. to L.A. To the same stadium. Wait, Marcus. The same That's stadium. Marcus. That's why we all start spending all that time in L.A. Please call me. Yes. Please call me yeah. so I can you come out there. You can come in studio whenever yeah, yeah. you want to come in yeah, yeah, studio. I, 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 anytime I, I, you're on the show. I, I, I'll give you a call. I have my people call your people. Okay. Yeah, Wait, hold on, yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Before we end this conversation, yeah. I have another football question for you, Marcus. And I uh -huh. understand you're the analyst. I'm just the fan. You played nearly a decade in the Molly, league. Stop playing. You know no, football. No, no, no. But I'm serious. I'm serious. I would have went – I still would have went Chiefs, but then I would have went the Broncos next. Mm -hmm. So why did you just skip the Broncos? Tell me. Because you educated me on – I should have – Told the Rams. Why. I should have went Aaron Donald. No, yeah. you didn't just tell me he why. Just told he didn't you tell me why not Mac the Broncos. Daddy. No, no, no. But I want to know why why he's not high on the Broncos getting Russell Wilson. I am high on the Broncos. Don't get me wrong. I think this the, the reason why we having this conversation in March is because we know what this division is going to look like week in and week out. I'm going with one. Staley better stop going for it on fourth down every time it's a fourth down. 
the the Los Angeles Chargers would have been a, a, a playoff team last year yeah. if he wouldn't have had. I understand analytics, and I know Mina going to text me and curse me out, but ultimately <laughs> I think it cost them an opportunity to get into the playoffs. We saw Justin Herbert go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Patrick Mahomes. They just didn't have enough on the defensive side of the football. Y'all, I cannot reiterate enough how big J.C. Jackson coming to Los Angeles is. Okay. I can't reiterate it enough. Oh, no, it, it, I got, it changes I, the dynamic of this division. I have to interrupt you because we have other L.A. matters to get to. What? We need to make sure we don't run out of time. <laughs> Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.